my friend see this is a laser line leveler first of all when you are going to assemble this first you assemble this front assembly carry this and put the these two pin after that you can put this draw bar then we come back side we have to attach the back assembly with this pin both side then we attach this then we can attach the tire and the axle okay after that uh, we can assemble this mast three bolt in the front three then in the back side first assemble this then you attach this one then you put uh, this pipe come close here this is a sport pipe stand here there is a special place come close there, there is a bolt fix it here and tie this screw and then you should fix this one tie the screw okay then you come back side there is a wall hydraulic wall the, this is the base special uh, platform for the hydraulic wall you put this hydraulic wall here there is a screw under the base this they can tight and then you have to attach the uh, connect this cable let's see how you should connect here okay there are three three pin one pin has a straight and the side pin has a different a little bit uh, curve so you can see here this is the special place for this pin you have to put in this way same okay then uh, the hydraulic pipe you come here you can see there is a marking uh, you can see clearly there is a p uh, one is a t p means the pressure you have to connect this p with the tractor hydraulic pressure this is this is the pipe hydraulic for the p that means this pipe should connect in that wall where is the my mention is a p that p means the pressure hydraulic pressure should go inside of the leveler from this pipe the outside the t t means you can say tractor or maybe tank then this t should be the hydraulic oil come to the tractor come back to the tractor you should connect in this way okay and how you can uh, put the hydraulic pipe among this uh, under this there's a special place and through this when you will tractor uh, run in the field uh, when tractor will uh, turn left and right uh, it can protect the pipe from the hook otherwise pipe can go to in the hook and can damage the pipe it will protect okay i think uh, uh, this is the place for the tripod this is stand you should uh, try uh, keep the tripod here and uh, tight with this one there is one screw uh, bolt is there you can tight that when you carry here to there when you go to the field or uh, transport on the road or by anywhere you can keep the tripod here it can be very easily here okay and the other things uh, then you have to uh, mount the uh, system this is the uh, receiver you have to attach the receiver in this way this is the top of the leveler okay uh, the face should be the in front of the tractor so that the operator can uh, turn behind and can see the signal upper signal uh, center signal the lower signal and the uh, connector let me show you there is a okay see this connector have the uh, six pin and uh, there is a six hole in the receiver uh, later you can see uh, there are six hole okay you should adjust here
and another side the same cable same cable will come to the control panel control panel there is a little difference in the connection let me show you see here six pin connector is in the control box but the cable have only six hole but that side the connector uh, have the six pin uh, inside the uh, receiver there is a hole so you must uh, keep remember this if you go to put this connector in the receiver it cannot be fit because here is a hole uh, there also a hole so this one is only for the control panel side yo chada you uh, let me let me show the other uh, okay let me let me there are three connector all have the different different this is the three pin this is a 6 pin and open this this one is a two pin two pin is for power power from the tractor battery and uh, you should fix this cable in the tractor battery with the tractor battery and then connect connect this one this is power connection and uh, this is three point for the distributor for this wall for this wall this is a three point three wire cable connect this three one and the center one is the six pin six pin is connected with the receiver okay there is a hydraulic cylinder see this one uh, you have to remember uh, how to see the cylinder should open from the down side no upper upside uh, don't don't uh, attach this in the wrong way opposite way it should uh, attach in this way that's the upper and this is the uh, lower part these two pipe how you have to connect uh, there is marking on the wall b a and b c there are two pipe no mention uh, no matter you can put this pipe with the a or b it doesn't matter but just remember this is a small pipe small pipe to connect the upper one and there is a little long this is for lower connection only this much a and b is doesn't matter you can keep in the a this one or b in that one is not matter okay. if uh, uh, some day the screw screw driver if uh, uh, sometime maybe have some problem in the cable or how maybe problem in uh, uh, control panel or receiver maybe your leveler is not working then you can see in the center of this wall uh, this one see when i push it is uh, going inside the same in other side also so you can take one screw driver or anything and you can push with the hand see leveler is going down see so if the tractor oil is already coming in the distributor i mean in this wall and this one is not working maybe because of any reason you can use screw driver and can push this one if you push this one leveler will go down if you will press this side leveler will come up that means if your leveler is working up and down while you are pushing this or not working with this cable that means you have to check out maybe cable is not connecting is proper way and when you will connect to on kar yoso see there are three three button this one is uh, on off this one is uh, uh, leveler uh, auto as you can see here auto uh, this one is auto automatic and manual when you will do is auto it will show you in the screen auto mode when you will do is then it will show you manual mode when the leveler is in manual mode 
that means leveler is not working automatically then you will make it down it will go down when you will do it up it will come up but it's not will go automatically for the automatically function you have to first fix on the auto see in the screen you can see there's auto mode when is in auto mode then leveler will work automatically by itself so now let's see we did the now is on and uh, when you do on and uh, there are the indicator in this small cabinet okay we uh, press the button down down side see now kaun sa dabao hai niche ka niche niche agar now uh, see that guy is pressing that down the button down see now is indicating here uh, do the upside uh, see now is doing up that means when you will uh, operate with this button this one is for up and down if you will keep this down you can see there indicator will indicate in the another side when you will do up then indicator will show indication in another another one then you can check if indicating here that means the cable is already fixed properly and the current is coming in the proper way okay now let we start the okay one another thing most important see now the leveler uh, you have to check the leveler pakdi uh, hai na okay see if the leveler if the leveler is uh, front side maybe have little up back side maybe little down maybe in this way up and down when you want to keep it uh, in level same level you have to adjust from this one show this one when i'm doing this see can you see no mayo but you have to remember go back side and power this when i'm doing uh, this adjustment you have to move this otherwise it will be fixed and will be damaged you can see here when i do the position is changing now the leveler from front side is going up back side is down when you want to make it in a level you have to do adjustment from here but when you are doing adjustment from here you must remember to keep the move this one otherwise it will fix here and can damage the leveler is coming going outside coming inside once you fix already make the level equal then no need to change this one you no need to have to do anything with this after it okay you can lock it lock it see it went you can fix this adjustment only in the beginning only one time you have to do the fix not every day not every time when is already equal from the ground is finish the last adjustment okay now we start the tracker and let's see how to operate and how the leveler is working okay start the tracker